Hey y'all, I'm James Wright. Welcome back to Wizards News. And I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. <laughs> It's Monday, and that means Wizards Unite news. So there has been a good deal going on this week. Uh, finally, Wizards Unite has broken silence. WB is speaking out, and there are things that are happening. So um, yes, lots to talk about. Let's dive in. So first off, early last week, there was an email that went out to a few specific people, particularly just a couple WooTubers and other social media types. And this was an invite to an event happening at Universal Studios in Hollywood. Ooh, and it is an exclusive event that it's offering to them. Uh, so we kind of know the game isn't going to come out before that event because it's an exclusive event for those people coming there and they're going to be showing off exclusive content. So that means that it won't be open to other people. So a lot of people are thinking that after the event, the game will come out. Uh, I'm still thinking that the date now is the 26th. That's going to be about a week later after the event. So that gives these WooTubers the chance to create a video and get ready. Um, and we'll be seeing more than coming up after that. So I'm thinking June June 26th is the launch date. That's what I'm thinking, but who knows? It's Wizards Unite Niantic. Could be any time. So as we're all getting excited about this exclusive event, which I didn't get an invite to, which I don't have a problem with. Um, it was given to a few specific people for other reasons. So I'm actually going to be flying out there. I'm going to be in Universal Studios Hollywood at the time of the event. Uh, so I'm hoping to hang out with other WooTubers and spend some time, but also be able to get a outside view of what is happening. I won't be seeing the exclusive content, but that also means that I won't be signing an NDA. So I can say things that other people can't say that I might just happen to see while I'm in the park. Could be kind of fun. Other things that have been happening, the Sylth, um, a fantastic channel on YouTube, actually did this amazing teardown of the storyline and went through all the ideas and pieces that we knew and compiled this all together and actually created an entire storyline for Wizards Unite. Putting all these pieces together from the trailers and teasers and things that we've found, he is actually able to create this entire group and it is amazing how this all comes together and everything ties together and you start to see the beginning of the storyline. And this is the big key thing for Wizards Unite. They're talking about this overarching, multi-year, decade-long storyline so that the game will constantly be renewing and being built upon itself. So I'm really looking forward to that. But then about a day later after this video came out, then Niantic actually came out with their their own teaser trailer video. And in this, they went through the whole storyline. And so they basically confirmed everything we've known about the storyline and went into detail about all the things happening. You get to see all the newspaper clippings. Uh, really kind of a cool uh, put together on it. And, and I, I, I think this is my favorite teaser all because it's really geared towards the storyline. People who are interested in the game giving a little bit more information. And I'm really, really happy with how that came together. On top of that, on the Wizards Unite blog, they then put out an update on the beta test and they started talking about the teaser trailer and things that are coming out and they're reaffirming everyone that we're taking this time, we're not just delaying the game to delay the game, but we're really making it good. We're making the quality very high quality. We're making everything perfect on this. And so they're taking all this information they've gotten from the beta test, they're reworking it, and they'll be putting out the game in the coming weeks. As you can see here in the last line, they say, we can't wait to share more with you in the coming weeks. So yes, we're getting excited. The game is coming close very soon now. Now many YouTubers have done a deep dive into the trailer. I myself did a video on that. I'll leave a link to that down below and up in the cards. Uh, but then also Expecto Go, one of the YouTubers who did get an invite to the event in Hollywood, did a really deep dive and looked at five things that most everyone missed in the trailer. And yes, he pointed out several things that I missed and was like, oh wow, I didn't see that. Um, kind of interesting details and probably the deepest dive we've seen so far on this particular trailer. So definitely take a look at that. I'll leave a link to it down below. And then last, this weird video went viral on Facebook and Twitter um, and it's showing Dobby in a security cam footage and it's really kind of interesting. A lot of people are thinking this is Wizards Unite uh, publicity and things like that going on. But no, this is actually someone who shot this video and uh, interesting is Dobby in the real world. It's like another magical trace that has come out and now the, uh, the Munkles are aware of this. So um, we as wizards need to jump in. We need to join the SOS task force and we need to be ready to unite because the world needs us. 
so that's about it for this week. It has been a really fun one, and I'm looking forward to next week. It's going to be, I'm guessing it's going to be a little quiet over this next week because we're getting ready for the event the following week after that. Um, but who knows what is going to happen. And I am really looking forward to the event in the following week. Um, being there in Hollywood and hanging out and probably be putting out a few videos, uh, meeting up with other YouTubers and having a little bit of fun there. So I think that's about it for today. If you have any ideas or anything I missed, I'd love to see those down in the comments. Also, if you want to see any links to everything I've talked about, they're in the comments down below. So I think that's about it for now. And until next time, have a magical day. It's chocolate frog time. Let's see who we got today. I hope it's something new. I've been getting a few of the duplicates lately, but today we got... Aha! Gilderoy Lockhart. I don't have him yet. A new one. So yes, Gilderoy Lockhart.